Another example of a profitability ratio is the return on assets, or the ROA. Return refers to a profit level such as net income or EBIT. Return on asset formula is a net income divided by assets. We can get the net income from the income statement and assets from the balance sheet. Please note that the income statement is a flow account, which means it is calculated over a year, while the balance sheet is a stock account, meaning it is calculated at a certain point of time. Since we cannot compare a year value to a day value, we need to convert the balance sheet items into a yearly value. This is calculated by getting the average of the two balance sheet items from the different years. So, we will use one income statement and two balance sheet items. In summary, anytime you find a financial ratio that includes an item from the income statement and an item from the balance sheet, you will have to use the income statement item and get the average of the balance sheet items. So, we can rewrite the ROA as net income divided by average assets. Let's calculate ROA for the year 2018. Net income is equal to 3.5 million divided by, well, let's look at the balance sheet for assets. Please note, 2018 is the first year of operations. Therefore, we do not have the average assets because we do not have the previous year. In 2018, we have assets of $100 million. So, in our formula, we will divide by assets of $100 million. This is equal to 3.5%. The unit of ROA is a percentage. This means that for every dollar of assets, the company generates a net profit of 3.5 cents. For all profitability ratios, the higher, the better. Next, let's calculate ROA for 2019. Net income is equal to $4.9 million. Divided by... Well, let's look at the balance sheet for the average assets in years 2019 and 2018. We have assets of $110 million in 2019 and assets of $100 million in 2018. So, in our formula, we will divide by average assets of, open bracket, $110 million plus $100 million, close bracket, divided by 2, which is equal to 4.67%. The unit of the ROA is a percentage. This means that for every dollar of assets, the company generates net profit of 4.67 cents. For all profitability ratios, as I said earlier, the higher the better.